What's up, everybody? Look, I don't give a fuck um, what everybody else is out there saying. This is my opinion. I'm going to give it to you. Canelo Alvarez really wanted to fight. And if Billy Joe Sanders really wanted to fight, they would have done what needed to be done to make the fight. The fight is not happening as of right now because of ring size and all the other shit in negotiations for this fight that I guess made Billy Joe Sanders' team feel that you know they, they was already losing the fight before they even got in the ring unless Billy Joe Sanders knocks Canelo out. Um, would I have done the same? I don't know. But uh, I know that if I really love somebody, uh, like them like my own son or whatever the case may be, uh, I probably wouldn't put him in a situation to where that I've seen today. Probably wouldn't put him in it. You know, especially like when their career, where Billy Joe Sanders is in his career, what an L would do, what an L can do to him, especially in, the, in at 168. So, who else is going to fight him? Uh, Demetrius Andrade or something like, like that. You know, maybe Demetrius won't. I don't know if he's controlled by Elvin Hearn or he gets to pick his own fighters, where the case may be. So, I don't know, but who cares? Um, look, you know, if Canelo is going to go fight, I mean, there's rumors out there that John Ryder is uh, talking about he'll take the, the last minute replacement. You know, um, they everybody get your money back. You know, if, if you're not getting what you what you what you asked for, you're not getting what you paid for. Get your fucking money back. You know. Nobody got no time to be watching Canelo versus No Bum of the Month. Even though, you know, yeah, it'd be his fault. He chose to do this. Yeah. If Can Canelo goes and fights somebody else, you know, yeah, it's his fault. He chose to do it. He made the choice to fight a last-minute replacement. If you think about it, because he could have gave into uh, Billy Joe's Demands just like Billy Joe could have gave it to Canelo's demands. But if it's a John Ryder, man, get your fucking money back. Ain't nobody worth a damn. Get your fucking money back. You know, people flying, tail rooms, uh, expensive ass uh, tickets, some expensive, some not, you know. But get your fucking money back, man. Uh, go on, go, you might as well stay there, maybe. Go on a vacation, but get your ticket money back. You should be able to get the pay-per-view money back. All that shit if this fight doesn't happen because they both choosing to, they both chose to give fight fans the fuckery. You know, you can say whatever the case may be. You can say, oh, Billy Joe Sanders got more excuses than Deontay Wilder. You can say uh, Billy Joe Sanders is scared of, 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 of Canelo. You can say whatever the fuck you want to, but it's Canelo's choice too. No matter how you put it. So it's both of their fault. You know? Um, I was looking forward to how Billy Joe Sanders was going to match up against Canelo. I was looking forward to it. I, I, even though at the back of my mind I was thinking he was going to get knocked out. But I was looking forward to it. Uh, just to see what it th I, this, this young man could possibly uh, do in the ring. But I'm not going to sit up over here and tell motherfuckers uh, uh, how to think. What they what they should pay for, what they should just watch on free TV or whatever the case may be, but in my opinion, it's their fucking fault. They're not giving the uh, once again, uh, uh, not giving the fight fans what they want to see, because uh, some people were looking forward to. Not everybody, but some people was, you know. So, um, there you go once again, and you know, like I said, if a, if a bum come out of here. Or a not so good fighter, you got we all know what the case may be is. Come up in here and fight this guy. What a travesty. What a fucking travesty. You know? And blame whoever you want to. But at the end of the day, you're not getting the fight because both of these cats. Shout out to the LDBC and everybody stay sucker free.